just press OK and see what happens. Now, oh, I didn't realize there was story here, guys. There's actually story. Here we go. Okay, that doesn't sound good. Ma oh, it's Bowser. Of course it is. Why did I think this was going to be a simple trip to the castle and back for cake and peach? Oh my goodness, what's he going to say? I'll be taking that cake and peach too. What? You're going to take the cake? Please don't take the cake, buddy, please. I think he's going to take the cake. I wonder what cake she made. Maybe it was... Oh, welcome to Super Mario Run. In this game, Mario will run automatically, which he isn't used to at all. And then what happens? Okay, we get coins. That's good. He'll also automatically vault over small obstacles. Awesome. So just as a quick note, I haven't played any of this game whatsoever. I haven't really looked at any of this game at all because I really, really wanted to just experience it for myself. All I know is that it's pretty much an endless runner game that involves Mario and all your favorite characters from the Super Mario world. So let's continue. Here he goes. He vaults. There we go. He vaults nicely. Okay, so he jumps over the small gaps too, which is pretty good. And he's dead. Uh, Mario? Mario, <laughs> if you make a mistake, you'll pop into a bubble and get to try again. Okay, that sounds good to me. Once you stop spinning, tap the screen to break the bubble open. A boom! There we go. Right, he's all little now. Oh, so you get two chances at this, uh, at the levels. That's kind of cool. I like that. Mario will automatically vault over small enemies too. Okay, he's doing stuff all by himself. I like that. They count as small enemies too. That's cool. The longer you touch and hold on the screen, the higher he will jump. Okay, let's give that a go. Okay, that's actually, he jumps really, really high. Look at this. Wow, okay, this is good. This is good. Can I get one of these? I can. He can get all those as well. Quick, grab it. Nice. That's what I like to see. And it looks like the arrows spawn in coins, which is pretty cool. Jump while vaulting over enemies to pull off some cool moves. Okay, here we go. Boom. Nice, that's cool. And you can get higher up as well by doing that. That's really awesome. Oh, the Koopas have special abilities too. Oh, that's nice. I like that. This is so awesome so far. And we can wall jump as well, I guess. Look at this. Oh, this is epic. I missed the pink coin. Why is the castle blowing up? Too much stuff is happening. <laughs> I hope the cake is okay. Oh, no, it's downloading data. Why? What are you downloading? So, so far, this is awesome. I'm, I'm loving it so far. So, uh, it's taking a while to download, though. Oh, here we go. It's speeding up. Good. <laughs> I was a bit worried then. Okay, here we go. Oh, my goodness. That's so crazy. Leave the toads. He just squashed the toads. Oh, my goodness. Did he... Oh, Oh, that savage Bowser has gone to a next level. Oh, my goodness. That was crazy. Did the cake survive? I, I hope so. Toad, what's going on, buddy? What's what's wrong? Oh, no. Princess Peach was kidnapped by Bowser. He also wrecked the castle and all the toads have fled. What can we do? I'm not sure. We can hit the tour button. So is it like world-based? Oh, this is amazing. Peach is being held inside Bowser's castle. Hurry, you have to rescue her. Oh, it's done by worlds. I thought it was like an infinite runner. Oh, this is awesome, guys. I am hyped. World 1 up and over. Let's do this. Here we go. 1-1. One, one. It reminds me of the old school Mario so much. Right, let's grab some. Let's grab these mushrooms real quick. He vaults up one by himself. We can grab these coins. I don't know what the... I guess the pink ones do different things. I've gone the wrong way. What do I do when I go the wrong way? Oh, you can... Oh, okay. Mario can get all kinds of gymnastic. I like it. Let's vault over all these guys. Press this. What is happening now? Can I, like, plan my next move? This is really cool. I love this. Right, planning my next move. Let's go. I don't want the pink coin. I kind of do, but I missed it, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> We've got two. Oh my goodness, this is so crazy. So I need to pause it. I can plan my next move. Do you want to go up or down? I'm going to go up, I think. Here we go. Up. Oh! Mario's got all the gymnastic skills. Oh, this is really cool. This is way more complex than I thought it was going to be, but... In a good way. Okay, let's see if we can hit this right here. There we go. There must be different ways you can vault up stuff. It looks like there's lots of different ways you can play each level, which is cool. I like that. There we go. So if I held that longer, I would have been able to get that pink coin. Go, go, go. Oh, I just missed it. No, I didn't get the flag at the highest point, but I got four coins up to 100. And the first level is done. I got three out of five of the pink coins as well. I did it. This game is really, really cool. It's like on a next level than what I thought it was before. And it looks like we have like different challenges as well, which is quite cool. I don't know what they do, but I love me a good challenge. Right, what's next? Wall kicking it underground. Let's do this. Oh, I love the underground levels. Right, let's get used to this wall jumping mechanic. That wasn't too bad. Let's go up here, grab all of these coins. I'm not sure how you die apart from falling down, um, falling down the holes, but I guess you're gonna die from these guys too. There we go. Look at that. Oh, I've got the gymnastic skills down. I can collect more coins by doing that. 
Oh, this is great. This is absolutely great. I'm loving this. And a trampoline, I'm guessing. Yes, it is indeed. Oh, okay. So you can't get killed by hitting into the Goombas and stuff because you don't actually get hurt by it. But there was a section just there that I missed. Can I go backwards? I want to go backwards. I want to go backwards. I want to go backwards. No. <laughs> Here he goes. Sliding down. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I could have gone up there as well. This has so much replayability. There's so many different ways you can go. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I'm so sorry, Mario. I didn't mean to get you bit in the butt by a flower. That's awful. Right, here we go. Let's go up to the top. Let's do some wall jumping to grab all these coins. So many coins on this level. I'm liking it. So if you time everything properly, you can get as many coins as you like. You can discover different areas. Mario, you have learned way more gymnastic moves than I knew you could in the, in the original games. This is awesome. Okay, let's jump, jump, jump. Oh, I almost got hit by that plant. That would have been... Oh, awful. I died. Oh, man. Okay, so I can... Wait, where's he going? Can he fly back all the way? I think I can choose whenever I like to pop it. I like that too. That's cool. So you can either start yourself again right at the beginning. Or you can die and go straight back to collect even more coins. So I'm guessing if you're very, very tactical with your bubble choices or when you die, you'll be able to collect even more coins in the same run, which is really, really cool. I like that a lot. Get those coins, Mario. Get those coins. We don't need trampolines. We wall jump around here. Right, next section. Here we go. Oh, I thought I'd missed that for a second, but I didn't. Oh! Oh, I only had nine seconds left. So if you leave it too long in your bubble, you'll run out of time and you'll die, I'm guessing. But I did it. Round two is done. Let's see if we can get world one completed in this video. Because I want to see. It looks like there's maybe boss stages at the end. If you collect five pink coins in a single play, you'll be able to challenge a new placement for the colored coins. I have no idea what that means. Oh, new placement. So it will change where the coins are. So this has mad amounts of replayability. I love that. And you can somehow defeat the plants as well. Right, here we go. Let's go on to paratroopers in Mushroom Valley. Let's do this. This might be a little bit more difficult because we've got some flying enemies to take down. But here we go. Oh, the graphics are awesome as well. I love them. They're really, really nice. There we go. He's throwing coins all over the place. These paratroopers are actually really, really difficult to hit. I'm not sure what those right arrow blocks were, but I'm sure we'll find out soon. Oh, man. I need to get I need to get used to Mario's new um, parkour trips because I keep thinking that I'm going to fall off and die when actually I don't. You have to time the jump so carefully as well when you want to hit enemies in the air. Really, really carefully. Oh, there you go. Okay, it's like a long jump block. I like that too. A nice one, Mario. Let's do the long jump. Here we go. Yeah, and again. Nice, Mario. No! Oh, I didn't mean to do damage to you, Mario. I'm so sorry. Long jump. Nice, collect all those coins. I need another mushroom, otherwise I'm going to die. Right, let's pause this. And wait until we go over here. And then up here. Nice. And up here. Boo, I didn't get that far. I think you can kick in the air, actually. I think that said it on one of the tips, so I need to try that on the next level. But the next stage is a boss stage. Let's see what they've got in store for us with those. From what I've seen so far, this game looks so clean. It plays really, really well. You can play it with one hand. You just need one tap to do literally everything. And I'm loving it so far. Oh, it's so good. All right, before we go into the boss stage, let's see what other options we have. Oh, before I forget, here are some tickets so you can give Toad Rally a try. Win in Toad Rally and bring toads back here okay that sounds good to me we can build as well there there's our tickets that we needed rally has unlocked what does build mean most of the toads ran away when bowser attacked it's just me here right now could you gather some of my fellow toads from toad rally i guess i could what's this it's like a gift box no gifts have arrived okay fine fine you don't have to remind me that I don't have any friends right now. So let's go back onto World Tour and let's hit the big old... Oh my goodness, look at this. World 1-4, Bowser's Castle Hangout. Try one out of four in 20 seconds. World 1-4 must be purchased in order to be played. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to buy this though. Because the app's not actually out yet. Or maybe I can? Oh, it, it worked. It worked. Okay, it rejected me the first time, but it actually worked. I hope. Yeah, here we go. Look, it's unlocking everything. Nice. So it looks like you get to try the app for the first three levels of World 1. And then you have to buy it from there. This is not a free app. But it looks like you can try it for free. Don't quote me on that. I'm not sure. Because I'm trying this a day early. So I'm not 100% sure. But it let me play the first three levels for free without spending money. So the whole app in total is £8. But it's a very polished product. And there won't be any in-app purchases. So you're all good from there. Or I'm guessing there aren't anyway. But now we've unlocked that. Let's go to World 1-4 and play through this bad boy. Here we go. Bowser's Castle Hangout. I wonder if there'll be a boss at the end. I have no idea. But there's backwards ones as well. Oh man, this is blowing my mind. The amount of different things that you can do is crazy. And you can hang from the ceiling. 
Oh man, this is nuts. Absolutely nuts. You're gonna have to spend ages learning this to do it properly. But I think we're good. All right, we need to time this properly. Let's go now. Here we go. Here we go. Do it properly. There we go. We don't want to go backwards. We need to time this one as well. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. Can we get out there? Oh no. Oh, you can't even slow down. It's so weird not being able to control Mario. It really is. Oh, no, no, I'm messing this up. I'm messing this up. I'm messing this up. Help. Thank you. Thank you for stopping me. Let's go now. Let's jump over you and you. Very nice. Nice. Again, acrobatic skills from Mario. I like it a lot. Let's avoid that. Go up to here and we should be good from now. We've got two of the coins. We've missed three of them, but that's fine. And we need to time this one as well. Can we get a Bowser level? I want to try and beat him by doing the classic thing when you hit the... um. Oh, this is what I was talking about. By hitting the axe at the end. Here it goes. Bowser's doing something. And it looks like I need to time it to be able to get over to his axe. Oh, man. Okay. No, I'm just going to jump. Okay, I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Help me. I don't know how I did that, but I did. <laughs> that was so bad. Get out of here, Bowser. He turned into a Goomba, so maybe that wasn't him. Hmm. There we go. We did it, guys. We did it. Oh, there's Peach. How you doing, Peach? Let me guess. Yep. <laughs> Your princess is in another castle, I guess. Cliche, I know, I know, I get it. I played enough Mario games to get this. Oh, look, you can defeat the red ones. I didn't know you could do that. There must be a way to do it. World 1 cleared. I got Rago Rally tickets. Yes. And I got Hammer on Hand. Thwomps Beware. Nice. Okay, so that's like a power-up that we can use. Courses from a new world have been added to Toad Rally. Nice. And we're going to check that out real quick. So you completed World 1. We can go on to World 2 all the way up. To world six but for now i just want to quickly see what the toad rally thing is because i have no idea welcome to toad rally i'm toadette the judge in toad rally you compete against the style of other players go ahead and pick an opponent do you want to use a rally ticket and compete in toad rally yes yes i do so if we tap the top one what does this do oh we've got to play against nintendo okay i'm guessing you could play against players as well maybe i'm not too sure don't quote me on that i have no idea Toad Rally. Here we go. Let's try this. Get some more toads into the world. In Toad Rally, I'll be the one to judge who the winner is based on how many coins you collect and how many toads showed up to cheer. Certain actions during a Toad Rally will help the coin rush gauge. When it fills all the way, coin rush begins. Grab those coins. The more stylish your moves, the more toads will come to cheer. Nice. Okay. Let's give this a go. Let's be nice and stylish, shall we? Here we go. Let's grab loads and loads of coins. I don't know what I can do to make this more stylish. I guess I can just kind of carry on doing the old jumps in the air and stuff like that there we go fling that style meter that's what i'm talking about nice oh i jumped that i didn't mean to keep on tapping it do a style thing in the air i think the style meters are just about to be filled fill it fill it there we go we got coin rush i have no idea what happens when we get coin rush and then oh we get double coins nice okay this is looking good i don't know oh my goodness they're popping everywhere i have no idea what's happening right now i need that golden one there we go look at that Oh, man, that's awesome. we got a checkpoint as well. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm so confused as to what's going on right now, but I think I'm doing well. i got another coin rush, too. Let's grab one of those. We get double the coins for a little bit. Let's grab all these three. And hopefully, this is enough to be able to get some more toads into our land. We are literally crushing it. Absolutely crushing it. Look at all these coins. There's so many. So many, but it looks like the um, the toads have started to disappear. I guess I need to do some more style moves. Can I do more than one style move in a go? I'm not sure. I'm just going to keep on tapping it and see what happens. Finish. 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 She stopped it. She stopped it early. I must have been taken over way too much. Who won? Good job. Let's take a look at how you both did. We'll compare the number of coins you collected and the number of toads you each impressed. So style points and coin counts both matter. What's it going to be? Who's going to win? Let me tap OK. Here we go. Toad tally. How many toads did everyone get? I got 32. OK, he's actually pretty close to me. OK, that's worrying. That's worrying. He's It's dead on. It's dead on. It's so close. I'm getting more, though. Here we go. This is better. I got, I got four of the pink coins as well. 217 to 197. I think we have a winner over here. There we go. We've added the toads on as well. 307 to 213. That's actually more difficult than I thought. It looks like I got mad amounts of style points, though, so we're good. Congratulations. The toads that were cheering have decided to join your kingdom. Okay, that's good. That's good news. How many have joined? 20, 30 red ones. I like that a lot. All right, let's go to the kingdom and see them in their glory. I want to see these toads arrive. Let's see. Here we go. They're coming out the tent. This is so random, but so awesome. I love it. Level up. So many toads have come to your kingdom. Your castle have leveled up straight from one to three. 
Okay, so that means that they build things here. You bought some toads. Excellent. With more friends like these, you'll be able to rebuild your kingdom. Awesome. So what can I do with them? So this is what it looked like before. So I'm guessing we can make it better. Something has arrived in the gift box. Yes, I've got friends. Let's see what's arrived. Hopefully like a new house or something I can put all my new toads in. Come on, open. What is it? I got all six worlds purchased. Bonus, I got some more question mark blocks. I guess that's a power. I got 3,000 coins. Okay, and 20 rally tickets for buying all the worlds. Nice. I wonder if I'm one of the first people to buy this game because while I'm playing it, it's a day before release. That's pretty cool. And now I'm going to tap build and see if we can actually build something. In the kingdom builder, you can get, move, and place buildings first. Try getting a building from the shop. Okay, let's do that right now. You can use the coins you've collected to get building. To start, let's get a bonus game house. Let's do that. Let's go into special bonus game house. A mysterious house. You can play a bonus game once every eight hours by touching this house. Let's get that. Sure, let's place it in the kingdom now. Let's place it at the front right here. I think that looks awesome. And there you go. Simple as that. Buildings will react when you touch them. Try touching the bonus game house. If you keep gathering toads at this rate, your kingdom will grow super lively in no time. This is so cool. I didn't realize it was going to be this kind of game, but it, it's got a lot going on, which is going to spend... You can spend ages in it. Do you want to play this game? I do indeed. Let's see what the bonus game entails with this house anyway. Bonus game. Okay, we're in the haunted house. Do I want to go up or down? Let's go. Let's go up for this one. We've arrived in a haunted house. I chose the wrong one. Look at all those coins that I can't get. Oh, man. All right, I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay going down for this one. So I'm guessing you have to go through different doors, collect as many coins as you can. I've got one coin. One single coin. This is awful. What's in my chest, though? A ticket. Okay, so I can play the toad game again. That's cool. Is that it? I got one coin and a ticket. I made terrible choices. I'm not sure you're number one, though, buddy, because we didn't really, um... Look at that. One and one. That's awful, Mario. But hey, you know what, guys? I think that is a perfect place to leave this game. So Super Mario Run is out right now. Now, as I've uploaded this video, the game should be out. It's, I, I'm guessing, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm guessing the first three levels are free and then you buy it for £8 afterwards. But as you can see, we've only scratched the surface and this game seems to have a lot more, certainly a lot more than I thought was in it anyway, with the um, the toad rushes, the different routes that you can go, all the different levels, the collectibles, you can build your own kingdom as well. This game looks awesome. I'm definitely going to play some more of it. But if you want to see me play some more of it on camera, please leave a big fat thumbs up. And if you enjoyed this video, of course, and if this happens to be the first video seen by me, please do consider subscribing to join Team TDN today for daily gameplay videos. Apart from that, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!